Today we're doing the Egnolac Strong Cap Clat. <laughs> Ready to talk backwards, Passion? Sure am. In fact, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Here's how it works. We'll pull a phrase from the bowl, and then we try our best to say it backwards. To help us judge ourselves, I brought along my handy dandy cassette player. Here you go. <laughs> Oh, thanks. Uh, why did he laugh just then? I don't know. Maybe you're just that funny. You know what? You're probably right. <laughs> All right. First up is the phrase potato salad. Seems easy enough. I'll give it a try. Mm, potato salad backwards would be something like Dallas on a top. Okay. Now I'll play it back in reverse to see how you did. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, wow. This is hard. You give it a try, Orange. Don't mind if I do. Hmm, let's see here. Potato salad. Backwards. Hmm. <clears throat> Glip, Lorp, Reminikin. Really? That doesn't even seem remotely close. You'd be surprised, Passion. Phrases sometimes sound totally different when played backwards. <laughs> Hello. It's me, Orange. <laughs> oh, Passion. I love you so much. I want to hug you and squeeze you. And... <laughs> Passion, you got to believe me. This thing's on the fritz or something. Uh, it's okay. I have no idea why my voice sounded so much like little apples either. Orange, it's all right. Maybe just try again? Oh, good idea. <clears throat> Glip, Lorp, Reminikin. <laughs> and kiss you and marry you and... <laughs> <laughs> it must be a funky tape. Uh, let's swap it out for a new one. Here you go. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I was pretty funny just then. <clears throat> okay. Glip Lark Remenikin. Hey, Passion. It's me, Orange. <laughs> grapefruit is way better than I am, so the next time Grapefruit asks you out, you should definitely say yes over here. And then... Uh... Aw, <laughs> oh, come on. Let it play out. Man, I do not know what's going on. I've gotten way worse at this challenge since the last time I did it. Well, I've really lost it. Well, either that or, you know, your friends are playing a prank on you. A prank? You think? Do people pull pranks that don't involve fart noises? Well, I've heard some do. Yeah. Huh. <clears throat> Glip Lorf Romanikin. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, they are pranking me. Oh, that's it. I'm getting a brand new tape straight out of the packaging. <laughs> All right, here we go. <clears throat> Glip Lorp Romanikin. Hey, it's me, Orange. I will now perform a dramatic reading of my diary, June 24th. I love <laughs> packing tape. That's what I was about to say. I love packing tape. You love packing tape? Yeah, uh, uh, that's just what I wrote in my diary on June 24th. Oh, see, I figured your friends just made up a fake diary entry. I didn't think that they were reading out of your actual diary. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, good point. Uh, yeah, that, that too. <laughs> it was a fake diary entry, and I also happen to love packing tape. Oh, you, you do? Not the time, packing tape. Okay, see, what I don't understand is how they managed to prank me with a brand new tape. It must be the voice recorder itself. Oh, good point. Get out of here, you devil cassette player. <laughs> yeah. Good thing I always carry a spare. <clears throat> Glip Lorp Romanikin. Potato salad. Wow, sure enough, you did it. Whew, what a relief. I was getting worried that furthermore, I have something else I'd like to say. I... I do? Yes, I do. I will now perform a dramatic reading from my diary. Ah, no! June 24th, I... <laughs> Where's the button? Ah. Where's the button? Ah. Screw it! Ah. 